14 minus 2x is less than or equal to 5. We're going to subtract 14 from both sides. Negative 2x less than or equal to negative 9. Now, when we divide negative 2x by negative 1 and negative 9 by negative 1, we have to change the direction of the inequality. It becomes 2x greater than or equal to 9, which when divided by 2 on both sides becomes x greater than or equal to 9 half. Here we go, 0 is in the middle, and 9 half is around here. Open brackets, open bracket at nine and a half, and it goes to infinity. So the correct answer should be answer D. Seven equation of a of the horizontal line that goes through the point negative three, two. So we'll graph negative three, two, and draw that horizontal line on the coordinate plane. And we realize that uh, the equation for that line is just the y coordinate. So it's going to be y equal to 2. Correct answer is B. E. Number 8. We need to realize that when we have negative 5, 0, the x coordinate is negative 5 and the y coordinate is 0. Therefore, for the first point, x is equal to negative 5. For the second point, x is equal to 0. For the third point, x is equal to 5. We, we're going to proceed as if we were uh, solving an equation backwards. So now x plus 5 is equal to 0. And for the last one, x minus 5 is equal to 0. Now we're going to multiply them together x plus 5 times x times x minus 5 and 0 times 0 times 0 is 0. So let's just rearrange them because if we put x plus 5 and x minus 5 together, multiply them together, we get a difference of 2 squared. So it's going to be x squared minus 25 times x is equal to zero and the final answer is x cubed minus 25x